Okay, so I'm here for your inspirational Wednesday, and I'm going to open you in prayer in the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Amen. Lord, thank you for this time together and for giving us this time to just take a moment and reflect to see where you are leading us and wanting us to be, as well as um, the paths you would like us to walk down in our own lives. We ask you to illuminate our hearts, our minds, and our spirits to see your goodness and your glory. We ask this in your holy name. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Amen. So today we are really focusing on stepping into God's greatness for you. Many people can get caught up in perfectionism, right? You're waiting for things to be perfect before you do something, before you move forward, but that isn't how God is, right? God asks you to be open to the Holy Spirit and to take the steps um, that God is leading you and guiding you to take. So stop waiting for things to be perfect before you do what God is asking you to do or before you take action or move forward in your life. When you do that, when you are constantly hitting pause or waiting for everything to be perfect, it's a way that you are not allowing yourself to trust God with the plan for your life, right? God has that plan. God created that plan. God reveals that plan to you right? And in the moments where you doubt or question, or you're waiting for things to be perfect, you're kind of wasting your own time. Because you're holding yourself back from the goodness that God keeps trying to give you, especially if you already know what it is that God wants you to do. So instead of holding yourself back, Focus on the fact that life is too short not to be doing what God is asking you to do. Everything does not have to be perfect before you can actually take a step or take action in a positive and healthy way to move forward into that greatness that God is calling you to. If you just stay stuck or you just keep waiting or you you know you keep waiting for that perfect moment right like there's many people who um try to wait for that perfect moment to make a really big step or even a small step if you keep doing that your vision for your own future and what god keeps trying to send you it's going to get clouded it will you're going to second guess yourself. You're going to question yourself. You won't move forward. You'll stay stuck. Um, and then you're going to have a lot more work through the, to work through to do later. So when you're enlightened and when you know the step to take, take it. Don't wait for everything to be perfect. Nothing is ever perfect. God is the only thing that's perfect. So waiting for perfection before you take a step is a waste of your time. And it actually gives you less joy than if you actually took a step forward and moved forward in the direction that God is calling you in. Stop being afraid of making a mistake. Stop being afraid of whatever that next step is. Step into courage. Step into optimism. Step into the truth of the greatness that God has for you and how God actually blesses you, even in your imperfection, even in your imperfection. And that should really help you to take the next step. That's it for your um, inspirational moment for today. We will touch base again tomorrow. We are also getting ready to launch our Awaken Your Spirit Challenge. So you will begin to see that on our site um, and on our social media. Sign up for the Awaken Your Spirit Challenge so that you can actually move in that direction in your life that you are really being called to move in now. That's it. We'll talk to you later. Ciao and are we ready, Archie?